Have you seen a have you seen a have you seen these guys that gyrate? They call them kegites. They get kegs of palm wine. They meet in a place. If you don't know, if you don't know who kegites are, the Lord bless your heart. But when we were in school, there were a group called kegites. All they do is they get palm oil and they drink and they start singing. And at a level, they become very intoxicated. So much so that if you pass, if you pass, there is a very high tendency that you will stop. Because they know how to make melody. And before you know what's happening, if you stay there, you tap your leg. If you stay there, you will nod your head. If you stay there, you will move your body. If, you are, if care is not taken, you start singing. Even if you, don't, if you don't know what they are doing, you will start singing something. That's how a Christian ought to be. David said, I will become more undignified. I will lose my decorum. David is the first care guide. I'm not supporting Kegel, please don't get me wrong. But I'm telling you that that behavior is scriptural. For you to know how to dance before your father and move to music. If you see a very, if you see a drunk man with music, you will know. Christians sometimes we don't even know how to enjoy ourselves. I wake up sometimes and I say, Lord, the next 12 minutes, I just want to dance offbeat before you. I'm not hearing anything in the room. No music. I'm the one providing the music. I'm the one providing the beat. I'm the one providing the rhythm. I begin to dance. My children comes in the room. Daddy, what's happening? Join me. Don't even ask what is happening. But there is no music. I am the music. You must know how to gyrate. They call it gyration. You must know how to gyrate before your father. You don't have to hear, you don't have to hear a big youth. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you know this, do you know what they call this kind of music in the realm of the spirit? They call it Allah. When I want to fight real battles, it's Allah I engage with my guitar playing and dancing in the room. Making melody. <laughs> and the next thing I see is that the Lord brings a word very strong in my spirit. And once I declare, woe betide thy enemy. It's called Allah. You want to pray, you've prayed enough. Try Allah. <laughs> Asha. I said, Elohim Adonai. Somebody, you are waiting for your wedding day to dance.
you are glorious, so glorious in your ways. You are glorious, so glorious in your ways. Father, you are glorious, so glorious in your ways. You are glorious, so glorious. Lift your hands, say, Yahweh, say, Yahweh.
When you get to heaven, some people you will be surprised though. You know why? You will see me as first leader. Because I know how to ginger, 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 ginger. <laughs> I, uh, I said, do you know? There is another fellowship.
are bigger, bigger than the big. Aya. You are great. So.
The Lord said, tell them to not ask me now. Let them demand and decree. The ball is in your court. Not to ask me, but to demand and decree. You have worshipped past the shadows and now your mind is light, your heart is light and your spirit is energized. Now that the words that you now speak, they are spirit and they are life. Open your mouth and declare now. You can part the Red Sea. Moses, why do you cry to me? Tell my people to go forward. As you ask, let me tell you what will happen. Right immediately after this service, you begin to see your answers. And the Lord says, I should tell you, they will line up after order. And they will line up each one after the other. They will line up each one after the other. Say the spirit of grace. Open your mouth and declare. Already, bro. 